call myself Mufasa, I would more so call myself Simple. You know, because that's just the type of person I am. You know, like, TikTok is the new Google, okay? What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kaya. Hello, guys. Hi, how are you doing? I hope everyone is doing good. So today, I have a video for all the girlies out there, okay? Now, as we may know, it is silk press season, which means that everybody is getting their hair done, okay? And me personally, I went to try to do my hair at home. Now, as you guys may know from all my OG supporters, everybody that's been here from the jump, I started off as a hair um, channel. So I thought, I'm like, let me spice up a little bit. Let me step away from the expert in school and all that stuff. All right, y'all. So before I actually start doing my hair, I want to show y'all all the products I'm using, and I want to show you some of the good new things that I got. So, of course, you know we had to order some items and we had to pick up some items. So I'm gonna show y'all these really quick. First thing that I got is this is all basically TikTok inspired. Okay, y'all. So the first thing that I'm gonna show y'all is this here. Oh my goodness, you can see the camera. It's so pretty. It's literally reflecting the camera. But it's called, oh, you can kind of see it now. It's called Wow Color Dream Coat. So, Supernatural Spray. It transforms texture and it's humidity proof. And yeah, so it says use every two, every three to four shampoos, shampoo, condition how dry and divide your hair in sections um spray it comb it through blow dry and then it you need to blow dry to activate it so yeah so yeah i guess we're gonna see how this works actually i'm a little worried because hopefully it doesn't mess with my curls. I don't think it's going to. I didn't see any complaints like that on TikTok. So hopefully it doesn't mess with my curls. Because y'all see these curls, right? So y'all probably already know what this is. Because I said it's TikTok based. Right? 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 So y'all, I picked up the famous, famous. Revlon One Step Volumizer, Power of a Dryer, Volume of a Styler. Mmm, okay, I like that. So it comes with, I guess it's just a brush. And it says multiple heat settings for completely drying or styling. So hopefully this works. I have a specific way on how I like to blow dry my hair. And this is not it. I've never tried this. So hopefully this helps. Um, because I blow dry my hair a totally different way, but we're going to try it. Okay. Y'all we're going to try it. So I'm going to get, get these other products that I'm going to use to actually like wash my hair. Okay. Y'all. So to actually wash my hair, I'm going to use this, um, Mara Mango, Mango, Mango oil exfoliating shampoo by my yell i love my yell recently that's pretty much all i've been using and a couple shea moisture products but majority of what i've been using for my natural hair is my yell um now what i will say about this it gets your hair really 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 clean but it's a really strong smell okay it's really really strong but it exfoliates and cleans your hair very very well um, so I'm gonna use this as my shampoo and then I'm also probably gonna go in a little bit with this argan oil of Morocco um, shampoo by OGX now I haven't used this in so long but I know it kind of gives my hair like a it strips my hair of the oils and that's why I tend to don't use it because I don't really like that effect but I'm going to use that because with a silk press, you need your hair to be absolutely clean. So I'm probably going to use a little bit of this 
but majority of this and of course two shampoos um two two washes i should say and then after that i'm gonna condition my hair with a my yell conditioner and this is the pomegranate line i absolutely love this line i literally have everything from this line i think i'm gonna use this hydrating conditioner and it's the sister of this one i've never used it before it's the smell is really strong but it is protein free and it has intense hydration so you're supposed to use an intense um mask or deep conditioner after you shampoo your hair so I'm gonna use those and then also we cannot we cannot forget this one important 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 thing guys please 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 I cannot stress this enough please when you are flat ironing your hair still pressing your hair if you are a natural girly even if you're not a natural girl please do not forget to use heat protectant now i just got this from marshall's it was only four dollars and i had a bigger bottle that was eight ounces and i had it since 2018 i had just ran out of it in 2022 so this four ounce bottle is going to last me long enough and i'm literally going to use this for every section that i blow dry and maybe a little bit even before i flat iron because these curls you remember i just showed y'all my curls they gotta come back so tiktok said you know, like TikTok is the new Google, okay? TikTok said that you should blow dry your hair and don't fly around it until 24 hours after that. So that's what we're gonna try. Okay? Okay. But yeah, so let's go ahead and get to washing my hair. It is completely washed. As y'all saw, I washed it very thoroughly. My fingernails are snagging my hair. But yes, y'all, look at this. It's about dry as a pat pat biscuit. And I don't know how I feel about that. My hair never looks like this after I wash it and condition it. So I'm a little, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I'm a little nervous. But we are gonna see how this plays out. So let me grab my comb to put the, uh, what's it called? The sprays in my hair on each section instead of doing like my whole head all at once because I wanted to really penetrate each section. Um, um y'all, <laughs> this thing is huge, my guess, people, y'all. That does, mm, it kind of smells good, actually, it do. And the chi heat protectant smells good as well. I probably could have did a bigger section, but let's just see how this section goes. Okay, y'all. Okay, What I will say, it's hard to get close to the roots. Like, I probably have to go back through with my regular blow dryer and really get my roots because my roots still feel wet. But the ends, the ends, the ends are straight. Okay, y'all, so I'm not going to lie to you. Y'all, it's not getting my roots enough. So, like, you see, like, this part is nice and straight. But it's really not getting my roots enough. And it's really, it's hurt. It's kind of hurt the wrist. So, I might have to just go back to my old ways of doing things. I'm going to see if that's a little bit better. Than that. 
Okay, y'all. So, this is the final product of my blow dry. I wanted it to be straighter, but I guess it's just not going to be straighter. So, oh well. But, it's okay. We're going to make work with it. We're going to make work with it. I promise y'all, this, this camera is not doing my hair justice right now. It's really not. But, I'm trying to think. What is fresh in here? I'm trying to think if I should wrap my hair around or should I put it in braids? I think I'm going to put it in two braids and then flat iron it. Let it just sit in those braids. Maybe the braids will make it. Strain it a little bit. But all this got to be flat iron. Y'all see all this hair on my head. Whew, child. This gonna take forever. But we're gonna get it done. We're gonna get it done. Okay. Hi guys, so I am back. It's a whole other day. My hair is blow dry, of course, like the day before. I went and got my nails done. Let's get into them. Got my nails done. I need to stop doing that. But yeah, y'all, so it's the whole other day. I went and got my nails done, my toes done, because I got something to do on Sunday. So hence the reason why I'm straightening my hair. But y'all, let's just go ahead and look at my hair. I don't remember if I showed y'all it um, yesterday, but I had put it in two braids to see if that would kind of help. And I think it kind of did, but it still looks really, really big. So let's just hope for the best y'all i am going to get a rat tail comb i have a brush so i'm going to try the brush method and i also want to try the chase method with the comb i think i'm gonna part it into like four parts and just go from there i'm really nervous like really nervous because oops everybody just fell off I just really want this to come out right, and I don't know. I have a feeling that it might not. I'm not really hopeful in this process right now, but let's not even talk down negative on it. Let's just, my hair is super soft, so that's a good thing, but I thought it was supposed to feel like crunchy. So you only need a dab of this. That's why I always get little bottles, because I never flat iron my hair much. So this little bottle has lasted me literally years. You only need a little, like a little amount. So I'm just waking up through my hair. They should be hot. I don't want to burn my ear. Cause that hurts. <laughs> yeah, this don't take forever. The kids are about to um, that is go by my cousin. Like I feel like this section is this section too big. Y'all, I'm so scared, like, <laughs> I'm literally so scared because I can go through them multiple times, so, that's why I have to take really small pictures. So, I'm just going to put that there, get as close to my roots the first time as possible, and then brush. I probably should wear a different color shirt because y'all probably can't see. But yeah, y'all. So I'ma um I'm gonna keep doing this and focus and then we gonna see how this turns out. Oh. 
Y'all, let me, let me, let me go ahead and just pause this song. <clears throat> Do y'all see my hair right now? I'm literally shocked. First off, stiff wear. That's first off. That's first off, like, stiff wear. Second off, it's way shorter than I thought it was gonna be, y'all. Like, this is my scalp. Like, this is my scalp. It's my scalp. Now, what I will say is, my ends probably definitely need to be clipped. Probably definitely need to be clipped. Like, y'all see this? Yeah. 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 So, I mean, we'll get those, but. Mm hmm. what she was supposed to do and I'm actually very shocked and that didn't even take me as long as I thought it was going to so that's always good like look at the difference eh? yeah yeah so now I'm about to do this section the back though that's gonna get a little questionable the back is gonna get, and I don't want to clip this up because I don't want it to get like, I don't want it to get like messed up. Okay, guys, so <laughs> look, look at this side, look at both sides, y'all. It actually looks really cute, but my ends do need to be clipped, like, I'm not gonna lie. And I do feel like when I wrap it around, it's gonna look even better. But now we gotta tackle the back part, and I really don't want to do the back of my head, like, I really don't. Look, it's so cute if I put it behind my ears. I almost fell. It's literally so cute, but. Um, yeah. This okay, y'all. So, as you can see, I did take a break on my hair. I have one section left. Let's look at how it looks. I think it's looking real cute, y'all. But I have been taking plenty and plenty of breaks. So, but y'all know I'm always going to. I'm going to get it done. But like she's moving, y'all. Like she's moving. Look, look at her. She literally, she's she's moving. And I just love this for us. Like I really do. So I did three sections. Y'all know that I split it into four sections. So yeah. The last section I have left is just this one in the back. Now mind you, I was gonna have my mama do the sections in the back, but I was like, mm. I might as well just get them done just because I can and I'll just do it even though I didn't necessarily want to do it. I feel like it's my hair. I should just do it. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, like you could tell the difference between this straight part and this part. Like it's too, y'all. <laughs> she looks so good. But um, I don't know where my clip is. Oh, she's right here. So, I'm going to take this and um, I've been taking these two parts because I'm trying to get my hair out the way as much as possible. So, I've been taking them, like the section in the back I did. Y'all, like, really look at her. Look, like, this is a cute hairstyle. Like, <laughs> I can't wait till y'all see the final product tomorrow because I'm definitely going to show y'all like after my makeup is done and all that stuff. Like, final, final product. But I'm just going to record the last couple of sections of me doing this part of my hair. Kind of look like Mufasa a little bit, but it's okay. It's okay. 
I wouldn't really call myself Mufasa. I would more so call myself Simple. You know, because that's just the type of person I am. <laughs> okay. But, um, yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and put this, my hair up on this side. And then, I'm going to do this last side. And then, we're going to be done. And then, tomorrow, I'm going to come back and show y'all like, how cute I look with my outfit on and my hair and everything. And I literally have to leave in like probably like a minute. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna see how this looks. I just put them in at like 12, so and it's two something, so they might not be that curly, but I feel like it will just and I didn't like sit on the dryer either. It'll give it some like body, you know. And I did these upwards, so hopefully I did that right. I don't want to really call them out because um, the place is an hour away wherever I'm going to, and so they're going to fall. Guys, she is so pretty. Like, look. My hair came out literally so cute. And I am literally so happy with the results right now. Like, can y'all see this right now? Can y'all see how she looks? She is moving and doing what she's supposed to do. I'm so happy right now. Oh, yes. Yes, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and close out this video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.